Hey, Coach, can you hear us? What's up? Not too much. Thank you for joining us. We will start as soon as a hand is raised in Zoom. And we've got one from Sarah Spencer. Hey, Lloyd, um, you guys were able to, to cut it to three for a while there in that third quarter, but then they kind of got a, a big swing in, in their favor. What were your biggest takeaways from from um, that third quarter? You know, I, I think as simple as it may sound, um, you know, we had, I think, two or three shots to cut it, to tie into that lead, 76-79, they were up. We had a couple good looks, Brandon, I think, in solo, and – to me, that possession summed up the rest of the game. We couldn't make the open shots, and, and they hit a couple big ones. And all of a sudden, you think you can tie the ball game up and kind of swing the momentum. And and as they were hitting the shots, it went up to about 15 after that. Uh, I, I, I can't take away the looks. I thought we had some really good looks down the stretch from a number of guys, and, and they weren't going down. What saved us in the fourth quarter was our ability to get to the free throw line. I thought Cam and Kev, or Cam and Dre did a good job. But, uh, you know, they made big shots at, at a timely, in timely manner, and, and we didn't, and, and then we were just playing scramble from there. To follow up, was it good to see Cam um, kind of see the ball go in the basket a little bit more this game? You no, know, more, more importantly, I, it was good to see him um, playing under control, attacking the rim, getting himself to the free throw line to see the basketball go in. And, uh, you know, obviously seeing a couple threes go down as well, but just being able to play downhill, he had a nice slash for a basket. We just need to see him play, playing active, uh, moving without the basketball, finding some easy baskets to get himself going again. Um, one last one. It looked like Trey was holding his wrist at some point. Did you hear anything about if he had a wrist injury? Yeah, he's getting looked at right now. Um, we'll find out a little bit more about what's going on there. I think it happened on the charge. Thank you. Kevin Chenard. Uh, hi, Coach. Um, with Bogey starting, uh, what were you looking for? And it's unfortunate he got hurt, but um, did, did you get what you were hoping for in that respect? You know, I thought we got off to a good start. I thought we created a bunch of good looks. Um, you know, again, he hits that first three and, and we miss, you know, the next couple, uh, but, but they were all great looks. I thought we created some good ball movement and some, some great threes, and our ability to get behind the defense a little bit early. Uh, but that's all it was. You know, we're in a little bit of a we're in a lot of a rut and just trying to find our way out. Uh, I thought the best thing was to try and help Cam in a different role and try and get Bogey going as another playmaker out on the floor. And I thought our start was great. Uh, it's unfortunate. Uh, we'll find out some more information on Bogey, but it's unfortunate. Uh, you know, we didn't get to see it through. Any additional questions? All right, Coach. I, oh, Allison Maestrangelo. Hey, Coach. When you talk about the rut that you guys are in, what will it take or what do you need to do at practice to make sure that it doesn't keep carrying over game after game after game? Yeah, which, you know, the guys got to get in the gym and, and uh, find a way to get their, their shots going down. Um, you know, the tough part about it is we're banged up. Um, again, we're looking at another guy that's probably going to be out for a while. Um, you know, we don't practice in an intense way on, on a heavy, consistent basis. And so it's really just getting in, getting your confidence, making sure you get your shots up. You know, we're going over the details for, for each opponent, but I think individually finding our way through work. Uh, we, we have to work. We have to continue to work. Uh, it's a long season. Everybody goes through the ups and downs. Uh, but until we get healthier, it's the guys that are here that have to step up and it's just finding their own rhythm by being in the gym and getting some work in. Thank you, coach. All right. Thank you.